We're here at NPE and at the Eagle Eye Software booth. We have Roger Bostorf, who is the marketing manager for Eagle Eye. Roger, tell us about this GPS. Well, actually, Ranger, it's much more than a GPS system. Uh, there are lots of GPS systems out there, but what this system does is it takes the GPS data and marries it with software that's a management tool for the business. And for, by that I'm saying it'll do things like payroll, it'll do job costing, it'll compare estimates uh, as compared to what reality is, and you end up paying the people not for what they say they're doing, they're doing for you, but rather what they actually work is being performed. We've got people that are saying they're saving as much as 30 hours of payroll a week based on using our payroll system. And it provides a better job for our customers as well, because if the customer questions whether we did the work or not, we're able to show them a, uh, a breadcrumb trail of the actual work performed and even the sweeping pattern that the driver performed it in. So it provides a terrific management tool for the people to run their business. Not just tell you where the equipment's been, where it is, but rather to run your business. So tell me how that integrates uh, with the normal PC programs that somebody might have in their uh, in their business. How does it work? Well, our system is actually loaded on the PC alongside their system. So as an example, the data we provide relative to payroll will be fed to a QuickBooks application, for example. So it integrates from that fashion. Okay. And then you can have a variety of reports. Uh, what, what kind of uh, uh, things do you see? You see uh, real time if you want to? Uh, do you see... Um, Tell, tell, tell me how that well, works. Uh, what we do is we set up standards for each job, and then we load each job into a route schedule for the entire route. So we're going to do a time stamp of when the equipment enters the, uh, the geofence of that particular job when it leaves it. And then during that time, we're also going to track what's been done. Is there handwork being done? Is the, is the driver out of the seat? Is the br are the brushes up or down? That kind of thing. And then we're doing that for the whole route. So then we're going to take that data, the system takes that data and compares it to the estimate or the or the standard. If we're off by whatever deviation the customer wants to set up as a standard, we set it up as an exception report. But if it fits within the standards, we don't have to deal with it. In other words, if everything's okay, don't have to worry about it. We only deal with the exceptions that are beyond the standards that are set up by the by the end, end user. So we're helping that customer run the business by exception. So in a sense, once you get it set up, what uh, what you really want to see are deviations outside the norm. Is the, is the important part to look at because otherwise you know that your driver is doing things that he should be doing. Exactly. It's exactly right. So mm -hmm. if everything's within the norm, you don't have to look at anything. But if it gets outside the norm, we're going to know about it. And we're going to know that the guy's working and we're going to pay him, again, based on what they're doing, not based on what they're telling me. I'm not going to pay him for coming in and standing around for an hour or an hour and 15 minutes. I'm going to pay him when the, when the truck leaves the yard and I'm going to back it up by 15 minutes and pay him for that. When the truck comes back into the yard, I time stamp it again and I'll give him 20 minutes to clean it up and clean themselves up. But I'm not paying for more than that. Mm -hmm. And uh, it sounds like this would really speak to efficiencies as well because the operators are going to be tuned into the fact that there is a tracking going on. Not only efficiencies, but in essence what happens here is the, the good drivers love this system. The bad drivers they don't like it because they know they're going to be out the door. Yeah. We, uh, we talk about uh, GPS at the round table and oftentimes the people want to know what the payback period is and it seems like consen the consensus is about 20 minutes because uh, <laughs> you, you find your uh, operators that need to go out the door you didn't realize about before. What else would you like to uh, talk about? Is the software easy to integrate? Uh, do, you, do you need an IT person in your office to be able to run it? or We provide uh, a standard operating manual with step-by-step -step process to get implemented. We also have uh, a phone call away. Our IT staff is ready to jump in and help as well. We've got installations all over the country and uh, they're all working great. Uh, so it's easy to operate, easy to implement, and it's a cost saver. If, if you can't save money with this system, then you haven't implemented this system. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is there anything further you'd like to add? Do you think we've covered it? I think we've covered it, but come, come around to our booth. Well, the, uh, uh, the folks that will be seeing this, uh, where they'll want to head is actually to your website. How do they get www.eetrack.com. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a great day.